Hi, I'm Laurie, and welcome to your dumbbell-only lower body strength and conditioning workout. What you're going to need today, you guessed it, dumbbells. That's it. And whatever you got available, go ahead and have that handy. Grab something to hydrate with. This one is tough. It is go, go, go. Everything today is going to be 60 seconds on, 15 seconds off. There may be a couple points during the workout where we take a little bit longer break because your trainer needs it. Uh, but besides that, just grab all your stuff and let's get going. All right, so let's get to work. First four exercises, body weight only. It is our warm up. So coming up first, we have a side to side squat. So we're here nice and tall. Step the right foot out, bring it back to center. And we're just squatting side to side. I want you to really drive through the heels, initiate that movement through your glutes. 60 seconds on in three, two, and one. Let's go. Last three, two, and one. Next up, we have reverse lunges. So we take one foot back, really drive through this front heel. We'll feel it there on that glute and hamstring. And then we're just taking it to the other side. Glutes and hamstrings, main focus with this one. Let's go. and one forward lunges all right so this is going to target the quads a little bit more make sure that knee doesn't travel too far beyond that second or third toe feeling feeling it a little bit more along your quads alternate left and right we go now Last three, two, and one. Now we have a squat with an iso calf raise. Uh, that's just one rep, so fairly wide. Take it down, lift the heels, squeeze the calves, release the heels, and then drive through the heels to engage the glutes and hamstrings. <laughs> Let's go. This is our final exercise of the warm up. So it's down, heels up, squeeze the calves, heels down, drive it up.
seekers in the fast lane. Last three, two, and one. Go ahead, grab your dumbbells. We need one heavy dumbbell and then grab two moderately uh, weighted dumbbells for your next block. First dumbbell exercise of the day will be a sumo squat, heels in, toes out. We grab that dumbbell, drive through the heels. We're gonna work that inner thigh muscle as well. So drive it up and then control it. Three, two, one on the way down. We go in three, two, and one. Let's work, one count up. Three, two, one as we travel down. Make sure those knees are driving out, not in. Last three, two, and set that dumbbell off to the side. We're going to reverse lunges. We're alternating. Grab a set of dumbbells. So we did this in the warm up. This time we're adding some resistance to it. Alternate those reverse lunges. In three, two, and one. Need is patient. Go run away, get it out of your system. Come back when you're older. Go find a place where you can be the and come back when you're older Go catch the storm Within your broken bones And be wild, wild, wild Wild, wild, wild. One, nice work, set those dumbbells down. We're going back to that sumo squat, but this time normal tempo. One count up, one count down. Get into position, external rotation of the hips, hit those inner thighs as well. We go, now. Summer's and you feel that this is your beginning. But it's okay, there is good in changes. Go run away, get it out of your system. Come back when you're older. Go find a place where you can't be the victim. And come back when you're older. Go catch the storm within. And one, set that dumbbell down. We have a reverse lunge, but this time, just the right leg is moving. Left foot staying planted throughout. Reverse lunge, amping it up a notch. Knee goes into the chest, all right? As an option, just keep a static reverse lunge. Let's go. Baby, I don't want to miss a thing. We can see. 
sleep under the stars, they can sleep under the stars, or hang out in hotel bars, driving somewhere in your car. We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars, under the stars. Baby, we're young, young, young. Oh. Three, two. And one, set those dumbbells off to the side. Now we have a goblet squat. So toes and heels are facing straight forward. Anchor that dumbbell to the chest. Slowly center, three, two, one. One count, pause. One count, drive it up. Quads are gonna get a little bit more involved. Let's go, slowly centric. One count, pause, drive it up. Glutes and hamstrings still working. You may just feel your quads do a little bit more work here. And one, all right, set that dumbbell off to the side. We have those reverse lunge to knee ends. Right foot is going to stay planted. Left foot does the moving. This is gonna really challenge your core as well. So you gotta keep that core nice and tight to help stabilize those hips. Let's go. Lunge, knee in, and then it's off. And one, set those dumbbells off to the side. Ooh, back to those goblet squats. This time, normal tempo. Straight up, straight down. Ooh, we go. And three, two, and one, let's go. To the storm, cause I need to be swept away, swept away. Ah, I'm cornered in the cold where you left me. Left again, left again. Oh. Grab those dumbbells, final dumbbell exercise for a while before we get into some cardio, front lunges, forward lunges. We did it in the warm up. Now we have resistance in our hands. Let's go. Your arms 
last three, two, and one. All right, body weight only cardio. We have squat jacks coming up. So we've been doing that squat. Squat right here, light on the toes. Option here is to do what we did during the warm up and just sidestep it instead of jump. Let's go. here for me baby okay lateral lunge to knee in is what we're gonna do next right side's moving only knee goes in violet can't come in unless you have pants on let's go in <laughs> three two lateral lunge knee in let's go side next on the knee in really try to engage your lower abdominals it's gonna burn out one side two more exercises then we're gonna get a longer break thank goodness here we go three two and one Final exercise, Malia, stand right here, please. We have speed skating lunges. So we're working on traveling side to side, creating as much distance as possible. Keep the core tight, keep the hips level. To the wall in front of you, option curtsy lunges. Let's go. Mm-hmm. 
two, one. Nice work. Grab a drink of water, meet me back on your mat with one heavy dumbbell and then two moderately weighted dumbbells, all right? Grab that drink, we deserve it. All right, so our first two exercises will be B stance RDLs. So 80% of the weight is in the right heel, 20 in the back toe. So keep the hips nice and level, core stays tight. We're gonna take those dumbbells down right below the knees, tension in the glutes and hamstrings, and then use the lower body to initiate that movement on the way back up. Short range of motion, so just below the knees, right by the shin. Then we take it back up, 60 seconds on. In three, two, and one, let's work. Other side, full disclosure, my butt started to cramp up right there. Perfect, that's what I kinda wanted to do. All right, we're challenging ourselves. Left foot, same exact thing. We should feel this along the left glute, left hamstring. Let's go. Lateral RDLs. Ooh, this is gonna be a burnout, all right? So, equal weight in both feet. We're hinging back, but we're not feeling it in the low back. We're initiating from the glutes and hamstrings. Let's go. one all right we have hip hinge dumbbell swings this is a power exercise so it's coming to our shoulder level but i'm not feeling any resistance in my shoulder think of it as a power glute and hamstring exercise keep that hip hinge motion let's go so we're using the lower body to get that dumbbell up the dumbbell is along for the ride squeeze the glutes at the top but keep a neutral low back Stay in bed. 
that you're next to me Stuck in my head When lights go off You're everything that I could ever want Your touch so soft Not looking for no, no, no Three, two, one. Nice work. All right, that was so nice. We're gonna do it twice. B-stands, RDLs. This is gonna be fun. Slow eccentric this round. Three second eccentric, make it burn. Let's go. Three, two, one. One count pause, one count bring it up, slow it down. One, glute is shaking. All right, that's what I like. That's what I trained for. All right, other side, slow eccentric. Doesn't matter how many reps we get in. Uh, we're, we're trying to match, but quality reps is what I'm trying to get at. Let's go, left side, slow eccentric. And one bilateral RDLs. All right, two more dumbbell exercises left. Then we're done with these dumbbells. Slow eccentric, still equal weight in both feet. Glutes and hamstrings are the stars. Let's go. All right, we're done with these dumbbells. Grab that heavier dumbbell if you need to lighten the load. Hip hinge swing, what I see all the time is a squat to a, sh a front raise. It's not that. We shouldn't feel it in the shoulders at all. Power exercise with those glutes and hamstrings. Let's go. Three, 
three, two, and one. Okay, dumbbells out of the way. Four cardio exercises, then we're done. Four squats, paw squats to a frogger. Four, three, two, and then we explode. Let's go. Option here would be to do a calf raise instead of jump. We're not done. We have a lateral lunge to reverse lunge. We've done them both separately. We combine it. Right leg moves only. This leg stays planted. Let's go. Knee in. Reverse lunge. Knee in. I gotta move a little. Make sure there's not a wall behind you. the other side. This is challenging. Two more exercises and we're done. Final unilateral exercise. Really try to engage the abdominals as that knee goes in. Let's go. Final exercise, Heisman. We're traveling the mat. Three, two, hold. Three, two, hold. Knee goes in. As the knee goes in, engage the abs. Final 30, we're gonna pick it up. Let's go. On our final 30 seconds, we're tired, we're fatigued, but we're about to push ourselves a little bit more in three, two, final 30, let's go.
Last three, two, and one. Nice work. Oh my goodness. All right. Slow down the breath. I'm talking to myself, but uh, forgive me. All right, let's stretch it out. Oh, inhale, arms reach up. And as we exhale, start to hinge the knees and bring that right knee back. Now, I didn't tell you to grab a mat so you can stay right here. Or if you do have something cushy where you don't have sensitive knees, let's release that right knee. <laughs> this is gonna feel better. All right, we're bringing it forward, right hip flexor forward, but let's keep that neutral spine coming into this a little different. Inhale, right arm up, exhale, twist. Oh, feels good. Ooh. All right, let's hit that other side. I've been doing my lunges a little differently. I like it. Neutral spine, inhale. Exhale, come forward slightly. If you wanna increase the stretch, inhale, left arm up, and exhale. Just bring it like so. All right, when we're ready, go ahead, take it to a standing position. You can do this lying on a mat if you have one. I didn't tell you to grab one, so we're gonna do it standing. If you need something to help brace yourself, use a wall, chair, just something to help stabilize the hips. Left foot crosses over, I'll give you a different view, the quad, and then start to hinge the knee that's bent, drive it back to the back wall, and then hinge a little bit more. So you should feel it along this area, right along that glute, outer left glute, unless you're doing the other side. <laughs> I'm really bad at mirroring. All right, let's hit that other side. A few more stretches, then we're going along our merry way. Give yourself that time to stretch. I do more stretching than what we have at the end of this video. I have just stretching videos if you want more, but you don't have to do it right after your workout. Do it later tonight. Do it when you're watching TV. I know it's easier to just lay down in your bed. Trust me, I get it. <laughs> I do it. All right, let's hit that quad stretch. Feeling it along the front of the right leg or left, whichever one you're pulling in. But if you have a, a mat or like foam rollers or tennis balls lying around the house, sometimes I see it and it motivates me to stretch or foam roll a little bit more. So just having those constant reminders around where you live uh, might be good. That's something I do. Little tip, you may like it, you may not. Just sharing, <laughs> TMI, I know I talk too much. Still love you. All right, final stretch of the day. It's just gonna be a nice round of breath together. Inhale, up, exhale, open, look up. Let's do that again, inhale, and exhale, open. Nice work today. That was really challenging. I don't know how you'd ever wanna go for round two, you're more than welcome to do it. My name is Laurie. You rock. Happy and wonderful rest of your day.